Okay, so last time I showed you guys how to download FFmpeg and how to install it on your Windows desktop. So now I'm going to show you how to use it. First, we're going to open up the command prompt and make sure it is installed successfully. Mm, know how to spell it, right? That helps. Okay. So if you get this, you have it installed. If you got an error, uh, click on the link to my previous video and it'll show you how to install it correctly. So now that we have this, I'm going to show you how to add video filters to a video that I saved on my desktop. It doesn't have to be on the desktop. You can put it on any path you like. You would just have to tell the command line where to go. So I'm going to CD to desktop and we're going to use this video right here and we'll go ffmpeg initialize and dog.mp4 make sure you put the file type otherwise it's not going to work if we want to add a video filter we're going to go dash vf for video filter and we're going to use the negate then with FFmpeg, you have to have an output file. So we are just going to rename this dog negate dot mp4. It will it will keep the original file, but we'll just add another file with the filter. Enter. And so now it is downloading, as you can see right here, and it's done. And we can use FF play initialize dog and it should Hazard. smile show me your smile smile oh so handsome <laughs> he's so handsome okay that won't happen on your computer something's just up with my computer um you can <laughs> you can click on it right here Kaiser Smile! Show me your smile! Smile! Oh, so handsome! Okay, there you go. That's a very creepy version of my favorite vine. If you want to add different filters, we'll go FFmpeg dash filters, and it should list, yep, all the filters you can use. So, let's try another one. We can... I know there's one up here that I used for my video editing software, which I will show you how to do in another video, but, uh, okay, here it is, H flip. So we can go over here, it says horizontally flip the input video. So we can try that. FFmpeg, initialize, dog. Um, we can, we can try flipping the new, um, negated video, video filter, what was I going to do, oh, H flip, and then dog, H flip, dot mp4, and it's loading. Click on it from here. <laughs> Kaiser. Smile. Show me your smile. Smile. Oh, so handsome. There we go. So it flipped the job. Kaiser. Smile. Show Kaiser. Smile. So basically, it's kind of like a mirrored image. And we can. I'll show you guys how it worked on the original one. G initialize dog. Video filter H flip. And then dog flip dot mp4. Kaiser. Smile. Show me your smile. Smile. Oh, so handsome. And yeah, he just 
flip the other way. So you can go through these video filters. I know there's um, one that you can vertically flip, one you can blur, and there's also audio filters where you can add an echo to it. I'm going to show you how to convert audio file, I mean video files, to audio files using FFmpeg. So if you... You guys are going to get really tired of this vine at the end of the video. Initialize dog.mp4 and we can convert it to dog.mp3. And now you can listen to it on your iPod. Kaiser. Smile! Show me your smile! Smile! Oh, so handsome! <laughs> that is how you can do that. You can convert music videos to um, music you can listen to on your iPod. Or, let me see if I have a music video. I can show you guys how to do that. Okay. So, FFMPG. Initialize. There's Kaiser. Oh, Adam Lambert. And we'll turn that into Adam.mp3. You can also change um, MP4 files to AVI files like EG. Initialize dog. Kaiser. Smile! Show me your smile! Smile! Oh, so handsome! So, that's basically how you use FFMPEG on the command prompt. I am going to upload another video on how we're going to use these, these um, command prompts into a Python program, which is going to be our new video editing software. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to leave this video off like that. Have fun with the filters. Have fun making creepy dogs. And I will see you all later. Okay? Bye-bye.